Hey, how's it, gang? Aloha. Welcome back to another episode of On Fire Fishing Hawaii. On this episode, I was blessed enough to work overtime with Station 15, Second Watch. Uh, now you to watch, but um, so they got a bunch of new guys lately. So we decided to take them taco diving the very next day when I got off. That way we have that like team building and we get to trust each other and really get to learn from each other. But this is also before all this COVID lockdown stuff. So uh, let's go check it out and see how they do. All right, let's go. Hold on, hold. All right, I'm going with uh, these buggers here. Can't even see, sorry. Let me go on this side, let me shut over. Sun's coming down, all these black faces. I can edit. Oh, bro, this has been going on your show. Oh, yeah, you know that. You're gonna lose members, Joe. All right, here, I'm going with uh, 15 seconds. Second watch, baby. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hopefully, we get something and don't die. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna go try and head out. Oh, look at this guy, guns. Let's grab a fish, huh? Well, check this out. First thing I jump in the water, find this beautiful sea slug. Kind of almost Spanish dancer looking. And Mr. Uh, Sam is just chilling with him. And out of the corner of my eye, I see a big puhi inside this um, little coral head. But usually when there's a puhi too, there's a lot of fish. So I just peeked in there and I was like, Oh, I'm literally close to shore. And look at this, Mimpachis. I haven't seen Mimpachis this close to shore in kind of a while. So it's kind of neat to see them in just shallow water. Usually they're a lot deeper water and in more caves and deeper. But, oh, here we go. Nice little hole right there. You guys can see it? So this one's pretty easy because you can see that pushed out sand. But I don't really see the taco. So what you're going to do is you're going to feel with the, your tip of your spear and of course um it feels kind of like hard a lot of times it could be like a trigger fish or something but it feels soft and spongy that's the taco so and then usually once you poke them a little bit their legs just start coming out like this just grab this head <laughs> well try to grab its head <laughs> but that was small so i just let him go away so just swim let him go to let him grow right and i was swimming out going to the breakers Man, this school of fish, bay fish just came in. It was like hallelujah. And that's when Regan uh, called me over and said, Yo, I got a nice taco. So, being that this is Gabe's first time taco diving, we said, Hey, Gabe, here you go. We'll give you a shot, man. Don't let us down. Again. Nah, nah. Come on, Gabe. Get the taco, bro. So, you see how he's kind of um, poking it, jiggling it out? And then Jay's kind of help her, helping him out. So, okay, Gabe, just grab the taco, man. Once the head comes out, just grab his head. All right? Here you go. You got it? Oh, come on, Gabe. Just get the taco, brother. And a good tip is, especially if you have a beginner with you, make sure you unload your spear. Dang it, Gabe. Grab the head, bro. I got it. Here you go, man. Now grab the taco. Gabe, grab the taco. There you go, brother. Easy. Just grab the taco. Sucking Gabe. Sucker. All right, here we go. Chase it down. Strike two. Nah, but for real kind of game. <laughs> you better grab the taco this time. Amateur. So, all right, here you go. So, we're going to teach him how to kind of like dispatch the taco. Come on, Gabe. Don't be scared. There you go. Now, bite the bugger. Right between the eyes. You got it. Hey, buddy, you guys. <laughs> Let's do good. We good. Show how to bite with these eyes. Right it's right between the eyes. And you'll feel crunch. And then he'll turn white. You feel crunch. You feel like his eyeball kind of like if I be in between them. And you'll feel like a crunch. A little more time in there, man. <laughs> <laughs> you know why? Just choose one food or the other because then probably he's missing out with the gap. <laughs> oh, got... oh, no talk. <laughs> yeah, I think you kind of got him. You see, cut him halfway. All right, again. <laughs> I, well, if you fight him, you'll turn white. Did you feel the crunch? Oh, yeah. Okay, I uh, will string him up. You like string him up? Oh, I think it died from your bread. <laughs> All right. Nah, just kidding. Yay, your first taco. Nice, brother. Yeah. All right, it's a good day. All right, we finally got over the reef, uh, over the breakers, and 
swimming out, cruising, and oh, look at that. What I see is like the little thing is actually a moo. I know it's a baby, but it's just neat to see such good fish so close to shore. All right, back to taco diving. So I'm just watching this uh, honu, this little turtle, and then bam, out of the corner of my eye, I saw this. See the colored rocks? I bet you do now. All right. So that was actually a taco. I was looking at the turtle, and I looked down. And I'm like, oh, wow, it's a nice size hole. So all right, let's go see if anybody's home. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna just poke him again, tickle him out. Here you go, tickle, 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 and then grab its head. Boom! Once he came out, I was like, ah, I was gonna grab him, but once he came out of the hole, he looked a lot smaller than he did inside the hole. So I'm like, ah, let's go let him go. And what I was gonna do is just follow him. That way, it kind of trains your eye to what to look for. See how how good he camouflages the farther he gets away, almost just disappears into the murk but you're gonna just look for it when you get close he'll just turn dark so all right let me just try uh follow him and swim closer to him see if you can kind of make him out but see how well they just disappear because you saw him sit down right around here but oh there he is you see him he's that dark spot on the top of your screen he's kind of sitting down all right let's find another one so we're back on the inside looking for taco and boom you see that let me pause it real quick and then you can see that that looks like a telltale sign. I call this like a trail. So it looks like a taco sat down and ate something. So I go up, so go close, and then sure enough, look. Super fresh crab. So the taco must have just sat right on the crab and ate him right there. Makes a big mess. And then he probably goes back to his hole. So what you want to do is circle around real good when you find something like that. Just keep swimming around because either he's out of the hole and he's looking at you or his hole is close by. All right, you guys see anything? You guys look for any kind of discolored rock, any dark spots? You guys got him? All right, you guys see those colored rocks, the white and the reds? Look for that dark spot right by them. All right, here we go. Let me go zoom up on them. Look at that. Me, you know. What's up, taco? All right, let's go try to get them out. Here we go, so just line up. It's kind of hard because Sergi. But what I do is just kind of poke him. You see how he kind of turned over? Once he turns over, then you can kind of poke him a little hard. And then all his legs will grab onto your um, spear. And then you can just grab him like that. Super simple. Hey, mahalo for watching another episode of On Fire Fishing Hawaii. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. Please make sure you guys uh, to support the channel, uh, like and subscribe. And you know what? I really do appreciate all the positive comments you guys make. So keep them coming. And also on this video, I usually do a talk, a uh, catch and cook, but I gave the tacos away. So I didn't do the cook side, but you want to check out uh, some cool cooking vids. Go check a couple of my other vids that I do about taco. I did a bunch of uh, taco catch and cook, especially with the Instapot. But if uh, not, also check out my friends, Fish and Grills and also Hawaii Only. They do really good uh, cooking videos, especially for seafood and especially for tacos. So check them out, guys. All right, catch you guys in the next one. Remember to fish safe and fish aloha.